Okay, well, it's looking a little bit nicer out there, colder than what we saw over the weekend, and it is a pretty nice shot of the city there. You're looking live at downtown Pittsburgh. I love those shots. They really are nice, but sometimes, Kristen, they can be a bit deceiving when it comes to the temperatures out there. Yeah, absolutely. You see the sun shining, and it is a little breezy out there. Camera's not really shaking that much yet, but earlier uh, I was looking at one of them bouncing around in these northwesterly winds, so we definitely have a little bit of a brisk wind chill out there. It feels more like the mid to lower 20s across much of the area. Temperature is at 35 in Pittsburgh. Look at the dew point all the way down in the upper teens. That's very dry, chilly air in place, and it's really going to stick around for about the next two days. Temperatures only making it up to 40 in Morgantown. That's our warm spot. We're down at the freezing point in Somerset. Everyone else in between. Lots of 36 and 37 degree temperatures. That's almost 10 degrees below where we should be this time of year, and today and tomorrow we'll stay in that chilly mode with highs only making it up close to 40. Both days our normal high is 48. Then we're down into those upper 20s by the time we get to tomorrow morning. Radar is pretty quiet. We did have a couple of lake effect snow showers make its way, make their way down through the laurels and then up just to the north of I-80 this morning. Most of this fetch of wind has kind of shifted. That's keeping most of this to the north of our area. But over toward Williamsport, Bradford, they could get a few snow showers this afternoon. We can't rule out a flurry or a brief snow shower in the laurels or up north of I-80 tonight through tomorrow morning, but it really won't amount to much. If anything, maybe a dusting of snow in some of those areas. Now, temperature-wise, it's definitely crisp out there. We don't warm up a whole lot later on this afternoon. There we go up to 39 in Pittsburgh, 36 the high in Latrobe. This is by 4 o'clock. And then overnight tonight, the bottom falls out. As skies remain clear, we may get a couple of lake effect snow flurries north of I-80. Everyone else clear and chilly temperatures falling down into those lower 20s down into the laurels and ridges deep creek area down near 20 latrobe somerset donegal around 21 pittsburgh's low 27 tomorrow morning so definitely a day for the gloves tomorrow morning and a heavier jacket but through the day tomorrow lots of sunshine dry weather if you're traveling tomorrow or wednesday for thanksgiving beautiful dry road conditions and some sunshine. Look how chilly it'll be Wednesday morning. Lows in the lower to mid 20s, but then we start a nice warm up in the afternoon that'll send us back to normal with a high close to 50. So tonight today we're looking at 39 degrees, partly cloudy. Could see a flurry in the laurels or up north of I-80. Then as we head toward Tuesday, mostly sunny 38. Wednesday, the nicest day of the week. Mostly sunny 49. Great for holiday travel or if you still have to rake some leaves, blow some leaves, maybe put up your holiday lights. Now Thanksgiving, the high will be 49. But as we head toward the rest of the uh, the holiday weekend, we are looking at a chance that we could see Let me get on the uh, the right map there. There you go. Thanksgiving Day. We're looking at a chance you could see some rain showers Friday afternoon and evening. That could mean some rain snow mix for Black Friday shoppers, but the rest of the weekend looks chilly and dry.